Hi, my name is Phil Norman. I'm at the CSW conference 2014. Really honored to be here. I'm here teaching Ghost. Ghost is a very elusive sport fighting system for stand up. Um, the idea behind that is that we just don't go toe to toe. So it's constant movement and uh, it's all about just not getting hit. And that's the Ghost. Ghost. Ghost stands for. Don't get punched in the face. I mean, that, that's, that's, that's it, right? It's no acronym, there's no, it's just don't get punched in the face. Okay. Um, so that's what we're, we're looking at today. And what we do is just set it up for you, show you how we set it up and how we work it. I have to say right at the beginning, Carly has been a massive influence on this for me. Uh, my, my Carly training uh, was a kind of a light bulb moment when I was doing Numerado once. And I was thinking, oh my God, uh, yeah, this is what I've been trying to do for ages. I had a boxing coach um, originally, and he fought people like uh, Eubank, uh, Shigawe Malinga, uh, those, those kind of guys. So he was at, he was at a good level, and so I would train here with um, Sete Eric and um, Guru Dan and Santo for for my uh, martial arts stuff. And then I'd go back, and my kind of fight training was really was was with him, and he used to just bash me up like daily. It was it was it was one of those kind of things. Was that the at the bulldog? The yeah, bulldog? the black guy. Yeah. Yeah. You couldn't. The guy would fight with his hands out the whole time. Yeah, you couldn't hit him, right? And, and so the name is, it's like you're trying to hit a ghost. Because the first time I, I sparred this guy, and I'd, by the way, I was, I was, I'd done some stuff by then. First time I sparred this guy, um, he, he kind of went, yeah, let's go. And then all of a sudden, it felt like three of his mates had kicked the crap out of me. from all, And I didn't know where they were. And it was kind of like, what the, where is he? And it was like that. And, but none of his students would have the same form as him. They were all very good structure, he would, he would really insist on having really good structure, chin down, bringing the shoulder in, punching with the shoulder so it's, it's protecting the chin. But then whenever I sparred the guy, he was just like, <laughs> boom, and I was like, what the, how do I hit that, how do I, and I couldn't get it, I didn't, I didn't understand it, but Carly kind of helped me start to decipher it, I have to say, Carly was a big help in that. Um, and so that's, that's where we're gonna start from. So nice and easy, let's go, just nice and light, just, yeah, a bit sharp, a bit sharp, that's it, that's it. Yeah, tap, pop, pop, pop. All right, so you see how these guys are doing nice and play, they're not hurting each other, they're not lumping each other, they're kind of respecting each other. But he's just, yeah, just warming up and just moving it. Yeah, and just getting those shots off. And, not, and, and you're gonna try and actually tag him. I want you to try and just, just a bit faster, just try and tag him, try and use the force and, and try and, yeah, see where he's headed. That's it, and time. Okay, and then after that, we're gonna switch over. When I call time, we'll switch over. You're gonna go, your eyes are closed, and you get your own back. Your eyes are closed, Michael. you're moving. Look, he's got now, see him going right there. It's okay, you can do it. Okay, good. <laughs> no, yeah, that's it, good, that's it, and that's it. And we'll just pick up a bit quicker, a bit sharper, just a bit sharper. We just, I just don't want to knock each other out, but just pick up a little bit sharper like that. Right, see what, and time, that's exactly what I want, like that. Just nice and sharp, no blood, you know, it's just warming up, get that body going. We need to get that going first of all. All right, guys, is that cool? Sir, sir, sir. All right, play in the space. So, um, anybody not get hit? Everybody get hit? Yeah, everyone go hit, right, okay, so, what does that tell us? That tells us if we stand toe to toe with someone, a blind person can punch us in the face. <laughs> <laughs> that's what that tells us, right? No, that's what it tells us, right? There's no two ways about it. If we stay in front of somebody, a blind person could potentially knock us out within 30 seconds. How long's your round? Two minute round? Five minute MMA round? Yeah, you, you think you can do that and not get knocked out? Do you understand what I'm saying? Yes, sir. Right, yeah. so this is like a big, this is my thing, this is my like, right, I want to I do this thing, I don't want to get hit. So the first thing I can't do, and you can't, you now know, is you can't stand in front of someone. Because sure. at some stage, you're going to get hit. And I know this for a fact, on reflection, and if you look on YouTube, <laughs> you'll see, Ghost came because one of my end fights, like I seem to be doing okay. I was doing okay. And then this guy I was giving us such a kick into, this kick came out. Boom, and it's because I just stood in front of him. Yeah, and that's what it is. It doesn't matter how good you're doing, and you've seen it. I mean, how many fights have you seen where the guy's just battering the other guy, just battering him, and then just last ditch, eyes are closed, and boom, it's like, oh, I've won. Oh. You know, it, that happens, right? Spin around. Oh, and that's when I eat that shot. Yeah. Huh. Huh. 
down here, like. Big wind up, so I'm gonna take his head right off. Oh, just smash that. 